Well, breaking overnight, the deadline for a contract deal for Detroit's casino workers has come and gone. And now the three casinos are gambling on a new contract. Union workers have planned to walk off the job at noon today with no new contract in place. That's now just seven hours away. The Detroit Casino Council represents roughly 3,700 casino workers and is composed of five unions from NGM Grand, Hollywood at Great Town, and Motor City Casino. 7 Action News reporter Peter Maxwell is live outside of MGM Grand Casino in Detroit. Peter, what are the union members asking for in their new contracts? Well, this is the first time in history that Detroit casino workers are going to well, walk off the job, supposedly, at noon today. They're asking for higher wages and to keep their health care, and they do plan on walking off the job at noon today. It's the largest strike year since 2000. Thousands of union members from screenwriters to auto workers are walking off the job. President of UAW Local 7777 Terry Sykes is a dealer at Motor City Casino. The UAW is one of five unions that cover most employees at Detroit casinos through the Detroit Casino Council. Sykes says all they want is a fair contract. We're not asking to get rich off of them. We're not asking for the CEO's pay. We simply asking to be fair. If the 3,000 plus casino workers strike today at noon, they will join the nearly 250 nursing home workers, 1,100 Blue Cross Blue Shield workers, and more than 30,000 UAW workers who are all on the picket line. Certainly there's a contagious effect um, in that they look at each other and they see the struggle for higher wages. Merrick Masters is a professor of business at Wayne State University. He says the reason why so many workers are striking, it's in part because of the pandemic. People are clamoring to get back what they've lost and to restore the balance between labor and business. Other factors, Master says, include inflation and technology. For screenwriters, they're dealing with streaming. Auto workers are adapting to EV technology and casino workers are now dealing with mobile apps and virtual games. We really want that technology piece to be part of the contract where, you know, we'll have a say so on how they implement the technology that's going to affect our workers. While it's the biggest strike year in over two decades, workers also hope that this means record contracts. It's just a brotherhood and sister of everybody standing together, fighting for what we all believe in. And 99% of union members voted to strike and we'll be continuing to monitor this story as that noon deadline looms. Reporting in Detroit, I'm Peter Maxwell, 7 Action News. So much more to come on this today. Peter, thank you.